Here time now is 540 volunteering in our community. That's what many organizations need, especially during these summer months. KTSM 9 News reporter Shelby Cap is live in South Central El Paso to explain how you can make a difference. That's right, and this morning I'm here at the Salvation Army where volunteers are always needed. There's three main areas where volunteers can help out, and that's in the kitchen, in the thrift stores, and right now especially with helping with the migrants. And right now we're joined with Brianna Graves. Good morning, Brianna. Good morning. And you've been telling us, you know, right now we're standing in the pantry, and if you take a look, it looks like there's a lot of food in here. But, you know, when it comes down to it, you know, more food is always still needed, right? Absolutely. So what looks like a lot of food is actually not much when you're trying to build a box that's going to be for maybe a week's worth of five people. <laughs> yeah, so it's to feed a lot of people. You know, today KTSM is actually going to be coming out here to Salvation Army, and we're going to be filling up some of these food boxes, and you were telling me this is kind of the main list of what goes in these boxes, right? But what, what goes into every box all the time? So every box typically will have something like fries, maybe some beans. Um, we try to make it um, as nutritious as possible, so we always go in some vegetables, some green beans, Beans, maybe one or two, three or four of those. You just it varies. We're trying to make a variety of different meals. So that's the idea of it. We're trying, to, like I said, for at least a week or or something like that for five people. Definitely. But there's so there's some vegetables. You know, everything has to be healthy. But like you said, there's kids involved. So do you have some fun treats too? Absolutely. So my favorite for each box is usually our mac and cheese. So the mac and cheese, especially when it comes in the individuals like this, when we get these type of donations, is really exciting, especially because we serve a lot of children and a lot of families with a lot of children in the family. On top of that, we try to have at least two surprises. So we'll do spaghetti or maybe some SpaghettiOs or something like that. Give them pasta, noodles, sauce, something special. So it's like an enjoyable meal and not just like, okay, this is what we had to give. Wonderful. So a lot of these boxes get packed and you know, that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be packing these boxes. So we'll learn how to, you know, kind of mix it up and give everyone something different. But you know, you were also telling me this time of year, volunteers are needed in other areas as well. Absolutely. So this time of year is usually kind of busy, especially approaching Thanksgiving, which a lot of people don't look at, but that's kind of how we see this season. So we have our bell ringing season coming up, so we're always looking for volunteers to help with that. Like I said, our thrift store, this is when donations are high. Wonderful. And if you want to volunteer, you can do so by coming to Salvation Army and signing up or online. Thank you so much, Brianna. We're reporting live here in Central El Paso. Shelby Cap, KTSM 9 News. All right, thanks, Shelby. Your time now is 543.